Hello everyone, this is Pritam Shah and welcome to my YouTube channel Cognitive Coders. So today uh, in this video we'll see one of the biggest MNC's uh, data engineering interview question that is Tech Mahindra. Okay, in Tech, Tech Mahindra uh, interview, uh, what kind of interview question, uh, question they used to ask in the Tech round that we'll see. Okay, I got this uh, interview question from one of my LinkedIn connection. Okay. Just LinkedIn post I can see not from the connection. Okay, without wasting time, I'm going through the question first. Okay, let's go. So here we have two tables. Okay, so one is customer details. One one table has stored the customer details. One table has stored the order details. Okay, so we need to find out the customer who doesn't who doesn't have any kind of order details. Okay means who which customer we need to find out that uh, the which customer do we uh, which customer uh, didn't order anything previously okay so that customers we need to find out okay the okay uh, so without wasting time i'm going through my code so i have already created uh, like this one uh, cu customer data frame where the customer details are have stored and one um, order table okay or where the order details are stored based on the customer ID. So here uh, customer ID is given and here order ID is given order order ID 205 uh, is it is ordered by uh, customer ID 2 customer ID 2 means Rohit uh, 218 order ID is from uh, Shami. So like this 2314 also one order ID is Birat. Uh, uske, and now uh, 165 order ID is from 2 means Rohit Rohit one second order another thing so based on this the uh, table has been created okay uh, order order data and it is customer data so from here we need to find out for the example there is only five data I have given okay but uh, in real time there is, will be lots of data GB's data okay so there are millions of data uh, in e-commerce website tables okay so in that purpose what we need to do we'll see here what kind of method we need to follow what kind of park activities we need to follow that that we'll see here okay uh, so from here we need to find out the customer name uh, who have not ordered any uh, thing okay who doesn't have any order id okay so for this uh, first we need to uh, we need to uh, we need to join these two tables for getting uh, that kind of record who doesn't have any order ID so for joining we will perform the join so uh, 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 so performing the join uh, customer customer DF with order DF okay uh, the unique key would be the customer ID because the customer ID uh, uh, both the table both the table have the same column customer ID so this will be our um, uh, main joining key okay uh, which uh, which is the primary key uh, you can say okay so uh, so the join will be left join okay so I am put uh, after joining I'm put, I'll put this thing uh, in a data frame variable okay so now I uh, after that I will see what will be our data okay so before going to uh, before uh, going to that okay uh, first I am running this so I have already uh, already created the join join um, uh, how uh, how many types of joins are there based on that video I have already put in my channel okay please go and watch it okay we have multiple real time scenario multiple interview questions scenario uh, questions uh, from multiple MNCs and or and uh, startup or or uh, some um, product based companies okay so um, coming back to uh, my video so the choice is done join is done so from this from this join from this join document what uh, from this join df what i can see there is uh, two two, uh, uh, two customer name where the order id is null so i need to just filter this this thing okay so for filtering this thing what i need to what i need to do so i need to use the filter option how to use the filter in multi, 
how uh, how we can use it uh, that also uh, full details i have given here the filter filter wala video you can you can go through this my channel or i, I will give it in the i button you can see also see from there so df dot filter df dot filter here after that uh what we'll see now what we'll do df dot so for order id column i need to search the null value dot we'll use the is null option which is given by spark okay so now if i'll do the show what i'll get so uh, uh order id is null order id is null for uh, uh here something is a shoe i can see it is giving virat rohit shami why it is giving like this order id okay i have selected is not null okay it will be order id is null so that's a uh, okay in, uh, when it will be told that uh, who have order id so that time we, we can use the order id is uh, is not null of uh, function so now uh, i need the thing who uh, who the customer who have who have uh, have not done any kind of order without a single order they have told so that's why i'm um, doing it like this is null okay so i i got the um, uh, got the data now so from here i need to only select the name so because the uh, they they need the customer okay they need the customer name if they need uh, you can also select it like this dot select then df dot uh, name df dot name from here it will only return the customer name who who doesn't have any order id okay the boombra and bhuvi who never order anything from your website okay so in this way you can uh, you can solve this question okay it was a basic question take a uh, technical round one uh, and the question was from tier one okay i think tier two it will be much more difficult level would be more high okay so uh, i'll come with uh, with that kind of questions also uh, so if you have any other kinds of approach you can do and you can comment in this video section so that i also can understand that how other guy other guys or you are say, uh, solving the questions okay so um, if you have any kind of doubt you can also um, ping me uh, uh, and ping me uh, uh, in the uh, comment section so so that i can i can also reply okay uh, you can uh, for daily updates and daily quiz uh, you can join our uh, cognitive coders youtube channel and also the whatsapp channel okay so you can also follow me on linkedin okay uh, which uh, which is given in the video description the link all the links has been given in the video description okay you can go through so thank you for watching this video and please 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 stay with us and uh, help us to grow our channel okay to connect uh, uh, the other with other people who need uh, this uh, free content to learn the data engineering things because uh, uh, you guys will help us uh, only help us to share share our channel so thank you for watching this video please